we're coming in as a freshman, especially as a forward. You know, you got to get that goal. And while into the season, I've been pushing, pushing, and it finally just came. Nothing without the hard work of uh, Andreas. He got the ball to me and I just had to bury it. I knew it's nothing else other than that. Just got to get it in the net. That's what I did. Yeah, well, I thought the uh, the first half, you know, we, we had the wind and, and we got forward early and, and got direct. That was one of our plans. And, and to, they've allowed a lot of goals this year, so we wanted to get in the box a lot more, um, which produced a, produced a goal. And, you know, it's a, that's the a type of Dayton Flyer soccer that we want with Andreas battling like that and, uh, you know, really sacrificing his body. So that's what really caused that first goal. Uh, we were hoping to get two in the, in the half to try to put it away, but uh, we fell short of that. So we knew second half coming out, we we're going to be battling against the wind. And, and uh, you know, Richmond took advantage of that and, and got the uh, tying goal. But I thought we did, we did a great job reacting to it and, and getting the goal to go ahead. And then from there, it's just uh, uh, just really about will. And, uh, you know, I, th I felt we really worked hard there in the end to, to preserve the victory. Yeah, and, you know, overall, I thought our back four was good. Jack Pearson was uh, tremendous today and, and uh, you know, really led the way back there. And, and uh, But overall, you know, I thought uh, performance from everybody was, was real steady. And uh, it was a really good weekend for, for, for uh, our team this, uh, um, this weekend. Well, you know, it certainly uh, means a lot to me. Uh, you know, the opportunity that I've gotten here from uh, at Dayton from uh, Ted Kissel and Tim Wobbler has just been tremendous and, and the faith that they've had in me. And, you know, it's a tribute to all the, the great student athletes that have played here and, and been through some really great battles. And, uh, you know, so it certainly means a lot. I really didn't know much uh, about the uh, the streak until Jack Pearson uh, mentioned the other day. So it's only fitting that he got the assist uh, there in the end and, and uh, uh, brought home the win. Well, in the locker room, we've been doing a lot of like positive thinking. Like, it's the A10s now, so the previous like 0 and 9 games or whatever we had before us is nothing. Now we're 2 and 2. We're back in the conference, and that's all that is to it. Next weekend on the road, we just got to make sure we get a win. Yeah, we've got a little momentum going now. Um, anytime you get a couple of wins under your belt, your confidence grows. So, um, you know, we've we've struggled on the road, and, and uh, uh, that's what we've got to learn to do. We've got two tough games in Philly, and, and uh, we're going to face a, a very uh, um, courageous uh, Temple team and, and uh, St. Joe's team that's going to want to get a win. So, um, we got a lot of head, a lot of lot, lot of work ahead of us, but um, uh, at least we got some momentum and confidence going into the weekend.